Yo, 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 yo. How are we doing, yo? What's good? What's good? What's good? How are we? Let me turn this keyboard off. Oh, it's on Bluetooth. No, I don't want that. How we doing though, chat? How are we? Yo, 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 yo. Was just watching your recent video. Thank you, man. Appreciate you guys. How we doing? How we doing? Hold up. How are we doing? What's good? What's good? What's good? Yo. You say, hi, Harry. What's up, man? How's it going? Just watch the day in the life video. What did you think about it? What do you think about it? I know it's something new. I know it's not exactly my style of content, but you know, we try something new. Chat, should we put the new lens on? We should try the new lens. Let me know if this looks better, chat. Hold up. Let me know. Does this look better than this? How does this look? Let me sit down. Let me get in the chair. Let me get all official and shit. How does this look? Does this look better? Yo, yo, yo. Does this look better at all? Like that right there? Good? Bad? What do you guys think? Better? I've been meaning to put this new lens on here just to see. What do you guys think? Chilling? Okay. Oh, my chair's starting to be a little wonky. Hold up. All right. How tall am I? I look short as hell. I am 5'5". Five five. I'm not super tall, but you know, I don't really care. Well, let me... There we go. Hit the go live button on TikTok. Hopefully it works. Oh, I probably should change this up a little bit. I probably shouldn't make this on NVIDIA. I should do this on soft codec, a little bit lower bit rate. 30 FPS is fine. Let's do 720 just to be safe. All right. Bet. How are we doing though, chat? What's good? What's good? What's good? How is everybody doing? We're going to react to some setups today. I know I missed last weekend. I apologize. I've been super, I've been working really, really hard at uh, getting setups out there and videos out there for you guys. I've been extremely busy. But I'm trying my best to get back to normal. Um, put a W in the chat if you guys are here. What's up? What's up? What's up? What martial arts am I doing? Uh, the program I'm in is a mixed academy. So it has pretty much everything. Um, it's not like just one martial art. He does everything. So it's mainly just an academy. Uh, I am about nine months in. Um, actually, maybe longer. I think maybe a year almost now. But... I didn't realize I was followed uh, to your Twitch, so I just followed you. Thank you, man. What's the Discord? Uh, in the description. You doing jujitsu? Yeah, jujitsu's in there. It's it's mixed though. Like it's not like one or the other. You know, what I mean, jujitsu's mixed in. Uh, let me. That's fine. I'm only showing three. Live anyway, dude. dude. All right, lock in um yeah i'm doing about i'm gonna try to get through at least 30 setups today i'm gonna try my best i mean guys there's like 400 setups or 500 setups in there right now so i'm gonna try to get through as many as i can if you join the discord and you're trying to submit today it's probably not going to be c today um just because there's from ones from 30 days out so i've got to be more consistent so i'm trying my best chat we're almost up to three videos a week now i mean we're getting really really close to posting three videos a week on youtube um, if you're just joining in on TikTok, we're streaming on TikTok and on YouTube. So pull up either way. Um, but how's everybody doing? Welcome in. Welcome in. All right. Lock in. <sighs> Let's get into some setups, man. Also, if you are in the chat and you're going to get in your spamming, you're going to get banned. Or at least timed out for 24 hours. Anyway, lock in. Let's lock in on some setups. Um, if you guys are tuning in on the TikTok for the first time, you'd submit to the Discord and link in the bio. Um, but there's 30, there is hundreds and hundreds of setups. Um, so just lock in, stay and tap in with me. And uh, we're going to get through as many as we can. 
Um, all right, let's lock into the first one. Uh, let me open up all the images real quick. Let's close this too. Make this easier for me. This is Lucky, a 14 year old from South Carolina, and his main games are Fortnite and, uh, or, sorry, relock in, relock in. Everybody relock in. All right. <clears throat> it's been a minute since I've done this, by the way. So if I, if I mess up, don't roast me. Um, this is Lucky. He's a 14 year old from South Carolina. He mainly, his main game is Fortnite, and he also makes content to afford this setup at the same time. He also worked at a golf course over the summer to earn money to make this setup as well. He built the setup uh to he built the setup to make content play games and it took him around five days to build the setup however he's been evolving and adding it for about two years now all right so let's take a look and look at this guy's setup let's take a look brother Ooh, tons of personality i love to see that love to see the personality in the setup here pc looks nice i like the shelves dude these are nice what are you guys thinking about this? Okay, KO management. All you have to do to fix this is get two raceways. But other than that, at least you tried. Like, at least you tried putting the cables together. But I would recommend a raceway right here. Love the mouse pad. W. The room is a vibe, too. Chat, what do you guys think about this? Out of 10. I mean, I think for 14, this is pretty good. Uh, lots of personality lots of the 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 setup is organized well with good functionality and room i would say this is a solid nine i think the only thing he can do to maybe make it a little bit better is cable management with the cables here and stuff like that but other than that love the personality really really good setup <laughs> yeah this is beautiful man thank you for spinning looks really really clean Um, going on to the next one. Uh, this is Corbin, a 13-year-old boy from California who plays, uh, f I can't even talk. Who, oh my God, dude. I'm, I'm so washed, dude. All right, lock in. <clears throat> this is Corbin. He's a 13-year-old boy from California who plays Fortnite, Lethal Company, Mining Simulator, and many more games. He built the setup so he could play video games, and it took him many years of birthdays and Christmases to get the stuff he has now, and his dad helped him build the setup. Um, yeah, his dad helped him build the setup. That's pretty much it. All right, let's take a look. See what we can give him, what advice we can give him here. Thank you for the follows on TikTok, by the way. Welcome in. Yo, everybody who's here, subscribe, like, like the streams. Appreciate y'all. Um, on TikTok, we have a new subscription. So if you guys would like to subscribe to the streams, I'm streaming a lot more on TikTok. So yeah, anyway, lock in. Um, looking at this setup, I really like the organization of this. Um, I love the lighting on the wall. I think it's really clean. I love the desk, even though it's maybe not the biggest desk. It actually works for what you're trying to achieve here. Kale management on point. Love the raceway there. Kale management like from this area is really great too. What do you guys think about this? Kale manager on both sides is good. PC has a really good spot too. PC looks nice. This is really, this is actually really nice. He has enough mouse room to play the games. You know, he, I love the symmetry with the lights on both sides. The only thing I would recommend is maybe like a bigger, like a deeper desk. So you could have more mouse pad room if you want. But if this is comfortable to you, then use this. But I love the design and personality you have in the setup. I love the lighting, you know, and all that. It's great. It actually looks really solid. I also love the shoes in the, in the shoe rack here in the room. What do you guys think about this? I really, I think this is probably a solid nine, dude. Like KO management's good. Lighting and symmetry is good. I, I think this is a really good setup, man. The only thing I'd recommend is maybe making your PC colors blue. But other than that, really solid. Just to match everything. This is awesome. Really, really nice setup for 13, dude. Insane. I like this. This is probably going to be the thumbnail low key. All right. Thank you for submitting. Appreciate you. Locking in. Oh my gosh, we have another 13 year old. Hold up, boys. Lock in. Chat, what's your, what's your favorite gaming brand? Go. 
why I'm why I'm setting up this. Uh, this is Samuel, but he goes by Doghead Online. He's a 13-year-old from Finland, and he's in high school. His main games are Warzone, Rainbow Six, Assetto Corsa, and Forza Horizon 5. He built the setup because he wants to have a clean setup where he can play games and hang out with his friends and play racing games with his dad. That's a W. I, I used to play games with my dad, too, like that. Um, that's awesome. Um, he afforded this setup from birthday money and Christmas and lowing lawns, so he kind of helped out himself a little bit there. Here are the specs if you need it. And his dad helped him build the desk. Let's take a look. Uh, thank you for the roses, by the way. Thank you for the donations on TikTok. Appreciate you guys. Uh, YouTube went insane last time with the donations last stream. Lock in. All right. All right. This is... Um, this is Sam. So, Sam, looking at your setup, I mean, let's take a look through the images. KO manager is nice. Keyboard and mouse combo. Nice. Bro, the PC looks hard, bro. That looks sick. The racing sim's cool, too. Dang, he's got a full racing sim. Like, like the full nine. Looks like a little bit of a custom wood piece to hold both, too. Dude, this PC's nice, dude. What do you guys think about this? It's better than yours. All right, dude. <laughs> All right. Better than yours. All right, dude. I get it. <laughs> All right, but looking at this, I mean, I love this setup. I love the cars on the wall. I love the added personality. You know, you play the racing sim, so it's kind of cool uh, to see you implemented the racing stuff into your setup, you know? Um, but the, the monitor, I love how you mounted like this piece behind it to hide the cables through. I think that's really unique. Um, yeah, dude, this is a really insane setup. Nice custom desk. It's maybe a little dark because the images he sent us, right? But this is a, this is a vibe, dude. This is a really nice vibe. I, I, I low key think this is a solid, I'm going to give it like a 9.5, dude. I don't feel like there's enough, like, I don't know if it's just me. This is a really nice setup, by the way. The reason I wouldn't give it a 10 is I just see, like, little imperfections, right? No, you guys think it's a 10? How how willing are you guys willing to fight for this as a 10? I feel like it's very close. It just doesn't check all the boxes for me. I feel like there's a lot of rooms that are, like, walls that are empty besides the two cars. Like, it just seems very, like, the setup itself is really innovative and nice, but the room itself isn't. So... What do you guys think? 9.9? .9? I feel like there could be just a little bit more sauce. You know what I'm saying? Maybe I'm tripping on that. Maybe I'm tripping on that, but... It's an 11 out of 10? Alright, I wouldn't go that far. Um, But I do love how he matched the, the colors on his PC to his monitors. You know what? I'll give him a 10. Bro can't just spawn a new house? No, I'm not saying that. I'm saying just like decorate the wall more. You know, shelves, more personality. I mean, maybe put some car posters up here. Um, but I think it's, I mean, the setup itself is a solid 10. I love how he mounted everything. I love how he built a desk. Your dad's pretty crafty. If he can make a whole desk like that, it's pretty cool. Anyway, super, super clean setup. I love the uh, triple monitor setup. What, any other, any other advice you guys would give him, chat? Ten is a little low. All right, dude. All right. Like, <laughs> what else do you want from me, man? Dude, come on, man. Love from Germany. Appreciate you, man. All right, lock in. Thank you so much uh, for submitting, Sam. That's a really good setup. Give it a ten. Oh wow. Oh, wow, boys. We got another one. Back to back to back. We got really good ones here. Um, This is the Podium Couch Guy. Uh, This is a this is his room designed for sim racing, content creation, and designed for his YouTube, TikTok, and Facebook gaming stuff. And this is his setup. We don't really have any information on him, but we'll lock in. Let's we'll see what his setup's got to offer. Bro, what is this? Bro took a panorama of the room. Okay, this is what I love to see, though. Okay, the race sim is actually sick, though. The race sim is actually sick, though.
Nah, this is actually nice. This is insane. The reset, I think, is the most impressive thing. Bro, like, he took a POV and everything, dude. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Nobody's got a racing sim like that, dude. Okay, let's just look at the whole room as a whole, though. I mean, I love how he organized everything. Like, if we look at this, he's got the really cool lighting right here. You know, his paintings kind of match everything. I love the shelf, you know. The lighting goes in between the setup. The lighting throughout the setup is great. There's a kiss, uh, consistent color screen, scheme to it, um, which is really, really cool. And I really love how he, like, you know, he streams, like, some sort of, like, racing sim stuff. And he built this all like custom it's really cool i think that's so amazing that's so sick dude like dude look at this dude he's even got like <laughs> he's got spotify on a small monitor dude like that's how the levels he went chat this is the levels he went to make this car race him look that real look he's got a electronic like speedometer like that's that's a whole nother level dude like, that's crazy. That's amazing. That's probably one of the best race sims we've seen in a setup ever. Like, look at how permanent this looks. Like, you know, that's awesome. Looking at the PC, though, I love how he put the PC in between where he could use it for this setup and probably for the race sim. I don't know if there's a separate PC for it or not, but the attention to detail in this setup is insane. Like, the race sim is, has such attention to detail. I know what these are. These are called, um, the wind tunnel things. These basically push wind, uh, wind to you when you're, like, driving. It's kind of a cool thing. My dad has one. Um, but yeah, it's really cool. Dude, the fact that he, like, put lighting in this and did all the bars and everything, it's awesome. I would give this setup, a, obviously, a 12 out of 10, dude. This is, like, insane. This is insane. This guy is probably older. This isn't a 13 year old. This is definitely an older guy. He also has the original Xbox here too. And a Wii. Oh my God. Can I come over and play Wii Sports, bro? Nah. Like that's so sick, dude. Look, he's got a PS3, a PS4, original Xbox, and a Wii. Bro, which console y'all playing first? Nah, that's crazy though. That's awesome. And a race sim. This is definitely a man cave for sure. Love it. I actually love this. This is so sick. Thank you so much for submitting, man. That's probably one of the best setups we've seen in such a long time. That's so cool. All right, lock in. Uh, this is Pixel. He's a 13-year-old out of Washington, and he now lives in North Carolina. His name is Levi, and he got this set up from... Uh, I can't even talk. I can't even talk. He wrote this so weird. All right, this is a 13 year old. Um, I'm gonna have to restart this all. Fuck, damn it. I'm, I'm really rusty, man. I'm rusty. All right, lock in. Uh, this is Levi, a 13 year old out of Washington, and he lives now in Carolina. He got this set up from Christmas and chores and his birthday money as well. Um, he built it all by himself and he uses a custom. Uh, I'm not going to say all that. We don't need to need, we don't need to know all that. He plans on getting lots of new stuff for his setup, and he mainly plays Fortnite with an Xbox One to do so. Um, so it's an Xbox setup. All right, lock in. That was the most botched setup reading I've ever done. I apologize. That was a really bad submission. Can't lie. All right. All right, bro. All right, bro. I mean, it's not bad. The shelves are nice. I like how you did that. But the mic, I don't know what you're doing with this. I don't know why you didn't just mount it to the desk. Um, cable management could be obviously a little bit more tidy, but there's not really a whole lot of cables if you just have a, if you just have an Xbox. I mean, why would he get guy? he should get a second monitor bro why he has an xbox <laughs> he doesn't need a second monitor dude he doesn't, he doesn't even have a pc <laughs> um i like that i do like to see the uh the pegboard and stuff like that the keyboards and the controller 
chair is nice desk is nice it's just time to maybe upgrade to like a pc and everything you have a graphics card so i wonder why maybe you're saving up or something for your pc um you have a graphics card though you definitely should save up for a pc but overall it's not bad i'd probably give it like a solid six out of ten for a console setup i think it's not insane or anything it's just it's a nice desk very solid foundation when he wants to upgrade to a pc but yeah overall there's not much to it looks very clean though thank you for submitting all right not enough info there all right um did they say their name okay this is this is fox and they're a 13 year old this is fox they're a 13 year old located out of chile and their main game is roblox um they do youtube and they also grind content just to be like me apparently i'm not famous by the way don't ever classify me as famous um this is the first gaming setup they've ever made they use a macbook air no mouse no no keyboard no nothing and now they moved to a new house so they can decorate and they bought a new desk and chair cool let's take a look skip this don't rate this one l setup bro it's not that bad i think this is nicely decorated i mean it's yeah it's maybe not a gaming setup but little productivity setup not bad that's actually kind of nice l setup okay dude i'm trying to be nice dude like <laughs> jesus guys you guys are it. dude this actually looks not that bad this isn't this is a nice productivity setup maybe it's not a gaming setup but it looks nice it's not bad for just setting up a macbook and like being able to work and stuff but I will say it is an L for uh, for fake buying a mouse pad. That's a fake right there. There's no GA in the logo in the corner, man. Mouse pad got swooped off AliExpress. Bullshit. <laughs> Bro, see, I, I, people buy the Temu pads of mine, so that's what it is. Uh, you live on Twitch? I'm live on YouTube. But anyway, overall, it looks okay. I think I, I do like the, like the little decorations you have. It's very nice color themed wise. Um, what you could do maybe is get a monitor and then um mount it if you want and then put the the macbook to the side um but honestly not bad i think it's not terrible you know obviously upgrade some more over time but for a little productivity setup not bad at all i would say it's probably like a solid four it's not terrible it's not insane but i do like what they did with the personality you know what i mean the the personality on the wall and the stuff that at least they tried you know looks good color scheme is great too Looks really good. Minus a thousand. Minus ten thousand. Okay, dude. Okay. You guys don't have to be so toxic, dude. Jesus. Jesus, man. All right. No info. I'll let you guys choose. Are we skipping this one? This one looks kind of decent, but what are you guys thinking? skip it what are you guys thinking should i skip this everybody's saying skip okay it'll go in another episode all right all right not enough info all right not oh here we go Let's see everyone's saying skip still all right all right we're stopping at this one this one looks good lock in um let's also make sure we do this bam let's just make this on discord only we don't need that all right this is breezy a 14 year old located out of london um they afforded this setup by working little jobs in their neighborhood and they're also still in high school their main games are fortnite rocket league valorant gta and other games the reason they built this setup was to play with the boys and be able to sit and relax for however long i want to play they took around four to five months to build this th it took around four to five months to build this entire setup and yeah pretty clean all right let's take a look at the setup I, I think it looks clean from the first image i looked at but let's take a look okay this is already kind of nice dude the first image i love this 
Kale management, you know, it's looking okay. You know, at least it looks tidied enough. I would say try to tighten this cable and stuff, but I don't know what the heck's going on here. Um, looking at the pegboard, though, I love how you did the lighting on the bottom of this. I think that's kind of unique. Love the keyboard and mouse combo. I wish I would have seen more pictures of this, but love this. I mean, if I'm going off of this picture, I would have liked to get like a longer cable sleeve so that you can go down and under and up. That way it doesn't like show right here or get a raceway and hide it in the wall. But I love how you did the symmetry on this setup. I really like this like a lot. It's really clean. I love the the white with the subtle red throughout the setup. Um, it looks really, really nice. Um, so what do you guys think about this? What do you guys think about this? This is nice, dude. The one cable is annoying. Yeah, I know. Very, very nice. I would say this is probably a solid 8.5. I would like to see more personality in the walls, obviously. Like, the pegboard's nice, but... It seems like this wall's kind of got nothing, so... Maybe adding some more stuff, but... I really love your color scheme. I really love how you did the subtle red throughout the white and black setup with some nice hints of wood. Looks really, really clean. So... Thank you for submitting. Looks really, really nice. Uh, quick intermission, boys. Speaking of that guy, I have some new mouse pad. Uh, I have a new mouse pad collection coming out soon, and I'm going to leak them real quick for y'all. I leaked them on TikTok the other day. But here's one. What do you guys think about this? Give me some ops. Give me some ops. Give me a 1 through 10 on this chat. What do you guys think? What do you guys think about this? This is one of them out of the collection. They're coming out very soon. Let me put this on the floor. And then we also have another one. It's also in the collection. Right here. Another mouse. Pet. This one's coming out soon. These are all in the same collection, by the way. Mm-hmm. Tiger. And then the last one, which I think everybody chat, this one's all this one is gonna be this one's gonna be literally your guys' favorite. I already know. Yeah, this is already your guys' favorite. I already know. I already know. All of you guys are already gonna say this is the best one. I already know. There there is no doubt that this is the best one for sure. Yeah, everyone's gonna love this one. Um, it's got, you know, it's the dragon. It's got the GA logo hidden throughout the design. It's got, you know, the red and white, you know, very hit, subtle hints. What do you guys think about this? Very, It's coming out very soon. We're just fixing a few minor issues. We're getting some new pads coming in because like you guys can see on the sample, this isn't gonna be how it is, but there's like a little bit of pink right here, right? That's not how it's going to be. We're fixing it. Then once that's fixed, we're going to drop all the pads as the collection. It's just on this pad. So once we fix it, you know, it'll be back. But other than that, you guys can see, I just got this for the design, right? What do you guys think? You guys like this one? This one, everyone was saying that they love this one. Like I was showing people around me and they, they love this pad. Like that pad was their favorite. A lot of people love that pad. And then I'll go, as I'm putting them back, I'll show you guys. This one. This one's one of my favorite color-wise. This, this color palette on this is mad nice. I But I think by far my favorite one has been the Samurai one. By the way, the kanji in this corner... This one says Art of Vengeance is what it says. So if you're wondering what the, the Japanese lettering says, it says Art of Vengeance. And then like you guys can see the GA logo is hidden on the gloves. You know what I'm saying? It's hidden into the design a little bit. So it's not like big or massive. It's just kind of hidden into the design. This is by far my favorite color scheme by far. I love this color scheme, like this orange. It's like, it pops so much. So. It looks kind of clean. Should you make a blue and black one like that? I make a blue and black one. What, which one? 
I'll probably leave this collection as it is. But those are the ones that I really enjoy. Um, so yeah, if you guys would like to get one, gutsyaden.com. Uh, probably by the time that they see this video, it'll probably be out. But uh, yeah, for the for the VOD viewers, it's going to be out very soon. So let's lock back into some setups. Yep, I do ship to Europe. You will have customs and duties. That's how it goes. Um, but yeah. Let's lock back in, boys. You guys, well, So what do you guys think about the collection? What do you guys think about the collection? I was working pretty hard on it. Um, I was working on it for the last couple of months. I really wanted a lot of, a lot of like detail into these. I haven't done like a really, really insane design drop like this in a while. So I thought I would try something new. Cool. If you guys like it, that's all that matters. You know what I mean? That's all that matters. Like, you know, that's what matters the most is if you guys like it. Cause obviously, you know, you shipped Australia. I do. They're so good. Yeah, wait till they come out. They're going to come out in March um, very soon. So what's up, Steven? All right, lock in. Let's get back into some setups. I've uh, been working really hard on that, co on that collection. So. All right. Let's get some. Uh... Best energy drink, in my opinion. There's a bunch of good ones, but Red Bull's been kind of hitting recently. Anyway. Cheers on to the next setup, boys. <sighs> All right. This is Zerz Tech. He is a 15-year-old out of America, and he afforded this setup through chores and birthday and Christmas money. His, um, his main games are Fortnite and Minecraft, and he built the setup because his older brother always wanted one, too. Um, he built this... It took him around a year to build this entire setup, and... Uh, he mostly did it with his help of his brother and his dad. Cool. Hey, look. Lock in. Ooh. Ooh. You should try to get in contact with Kai Sanat. After this setup, I'll show you guys. I'll show you guys. Something. I think it's kind of cool. Anyway, lock in. Lock in. Um... I love the wall panels and I love how you did this shelf, but I would have gotten a bigger panel because I know they make different size panels. So maybe you could have gotten a bigger panel of this just to fill in the gaps, but, um, or done three of them across or something just to try to fit it. Um, but overall, I love how you did the rest of the room. Like the lighting and stuff like that is so awesome. The Xbox is clean. The setup itself, I love how you did the pegboard and like you held everything on it. I also love the shelves above the, um, above this too. The desk setup is very clean. You have a lot of functionality. Nice monitor arm. What do you guys think about this? This is really, really clean. I would love this, man. This is this is like a really chill one monitor, just gaming setup, you know, very chill. Um, I would probably rate this like a solid 7 out of 10. You know, I think it's it's like really, really solid. Um, nice personality. Maybe even eight. Yeah, I'll, I'll toss it an eight. I'll toss it a bone. I would say it has really good personality, you know, for a console setup. Very, very nice. Eight out of ten. Solid, solid setup. Hold up. Give me one second. I got an idea. I'll show you guys something real quick. One second, boys. Okay, okay. I, I just got to show y'all this because it's kind of cool, you know? Hold up, hold up, hold up. All right, all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yo, yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on. Come on. Saw some love for the boy. Come on now. Dude, that'd be crazy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Kai said that follows me. Yeah, but yo, yo. No, like subtle flex, you know, like. It was kind of crazy, man. I met him at TwitchCon before he blew up. Like, not like blow up. Like, he had like a small blow up, you know? But when I met him at TwitchCon, he was just starting to explode before the subathon. So, fucking cool, though. Very, very cool. I met him in person. I have a picture of him. You know what's funny, chat? I was taller than him. And I thought, I said, I told I told him in person. I told him in person. I was like, yo, uh, I think, <laughs> I, I thought you were going to be a lot taller. <laughs> 
<laughs> he said, all right, bro. <laughs> Jesus, dude. It's like... Oh, dude, it's funny. Uh, what's the best mouse pad made out of your team? Um, I would say, I, I would say Topo because Topo was like such an innovative thing, you know? Only 197 people though. That's kind of crazy. Kind of cool. Can you show us your setup? I will when I rebuild it for sure. All right, lock in boys. Let's get into another setup here. Not enough uh, info on this biznatch. Only two pictures, not enough info. All right. Oh, wow. All right, lock in. This is Ryan, a 13 year old from Pennsylvania, and he is a. I don't even know what I was saying there. This is Ryan, a 13 year old from Pennsylvania, and his main games are Valorant and Fortnite. And he forwarded the setup through doing chores, selling stuff at the school, and helping out local people. Um, he mainly uses the setup to watch to watch movies, find his future job, and play some games and schoolwork. Um, it took him around three weeks to build this entire setup, and here's everything in it. So let's lock in. Wow. Whoa. 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 Bro, what? Bro, what is this? That's crazy. I love the little stand you got for the charging stuff. I love where you mounted your mic, actually. It's kind of clean. I hope it hears you okay. But what the... Dude, this is amazing. Love to see the GA pad in there. <laughs> Automatic 25 out of 10. Um, No, but overall, I love this setup, man. This is insane. For, for 13? Dude, for 13, this is incredible. This is this is like wild. Like I love the PC too. The PC looks really really clean. That Trident Royal, that's crazy. Wow. Four four monitors is hella overkill, but like man. And then the chair kind of ruins the color scheme, but I know that sometimes it's out of your control, but man, for 13, this is a beautiful setup, dude. What do you guys think about this? I love this, man. I think this is insane. I would probably, I'd probably give this a solid 10. Honestly, there's not a, like 10 in the, in the way that it's like insane for a 13 year old. You know what I mean? But for like personality wise, I don't think it has that much per personality throughout the setup. I mean, I see the plants and like the little figurines and stuff. But I think there could be more done with the actual room and space. But this is insane to see for your age. Um, it's actually pretty clean. There's no way bros 13. I, I mean, hey, that's what he put in the submission. So, but this is super clean, man. This is insane. Love the setup, dude. Such an amazing setup. I would think the only advice I'd give you is some sort of personality in the room and if you don't care about that then your setup is perfect because it's it's insane so the fact that you did this from chores and selling stuff at your school is crazy insane dude such an insane setup for your age 10 out of 10. chat i'm giving you the option are we reacting to this are we reacting to this I'm giving you guys the options. Skip it. All right. Everybody's saying skip. Are we reacting to this? Maybe you should do Aiden Ross X gets Aiden. I don't know. Aiden Ross is kind of a brand risk, unfortunately. Skip this. Okay. Skip it. All right. Oh, he resubmitted here, dude. All right. All right. We could... What do you guys think about this guy? React to it? Yes, no?
Yes. Yes, react to this one. I got you. All right, everyone's saying yes. This is Aiden. Oh, no, wait. <laughs> Bro's saying hi to me, and I read it as their name. I'm stupid. Anyway, lock in. This is Jules, a 14-year-old uh, out of Belgium. Their main game is Fortnite, and it took them around six months to build this entire setup. They built the setup because they wanted a place to play games and chill. Uh, they afforded this setup by saving up money and doing chores, and they built this... They built the setup with the help of their dad as well. Thank you. I hope I'm in a video. W. Lock in. <laughs> Val player 100%. Um, yeah, I agree with that. Um, so I like how you put the, the plants to hide some of the cables or try to, and it also kind of hides the mount for the road thing, but... I just don't realize I don't really it looks super out of place if I'm honest I feel like the one thing you got to fix first is your monitor layouts um if there's a way to get individual mounts for both of these that would probably help out immensely um also the desk is really nice by the way I love the lighting I love how you mounted this everything you could mount your power strip um right on the wall vertically here just so it comes out of here and goes up um but other than that, I mean, the only thing I'd recommend is two individual mounts, one for your main monitor, one for your side monitor. And then, um, honestly, then it will be pretty plain and functional. But then I'd recommend maybe adding stuff to this wall, where they come down, whether it comes down to paintings, whether it comes down to like posters or shelves or lighting or anything, just come up with something to make it look not as bare. But overall, what do you guys think? I think it's not bad. It just needs some more sauce some little bit of sauce sauce i give it like a solid i'm gonna give it like a solid 6.5 val players now have the most goofy ah monitors ever all right bro <laughs> dude that's like that's like the people who play uh rainbow six dude i feel like they they have the same like the same mentality they got to see every pixel on their screen. All right, bro. Worst picture I've ever... What is that? How do you take this picture and be like, yep, yep, yep. That's the one he wants to see. Like, <laughs> dude. What? Like, come on, dude. Like, throw me a bone here. Cinematic masterpiece. All right, bro. All right. This is Mr. Cuber. He's from the Netherlands and he built the setup all by himself with no help. Uh, his mouse pad is from AliExpress and he paid for the PC and his mom paid for the other half of the main monitor. Um, and he built the setup by himself. You can't see the camera manager very well, but I assure you it's clean. Yeah, no shit. I can't see it because you didn't even take a picture of it, dude. <laughs> Jesus. all right bro looking at the setup though it's not bad um what do you guys think of this though i mean it's, it's very chill it's very calm you know it's not very cluttered i'd say i feel like it's pretty calm and organized no theme though for sure i give it like a solid six yeah that's probably a good assessment i, mean, I don't really think there's much they could really do to improve it honestly because like a lot of it comes down to just like the area they're in it doesn't seem like they have a lot of room to really work with but yeah overall it's not bad nice little calm setup hold on this is important hold on Sorry, guys. Papa Guts is going to pop up on stream here in a minute. He needs to grab something from me. Sorry, boys. Sorry about that interruption. We'll get back right into it. <clears throat> he needs it. He's returning something that I bought for him. Um, and he needed my card. So 
All right, lock in. Lock in. Wait, you guys want to react to this one? This looks pretty good. Let's react to this. All right. This is Allison, a 15-year-old out of Michigan, and they... Um, I can't even I can't even lock I can't even lock in bro my brain my brain's locked right now okay lock in <sighs> one more try this is Allison a 15 year old located out of Michigan their main games are Fortnite and Rainbow Six Siege and they built this setup to have a place to game and do some schoolwork it took them around a year to build the entire setup and they afforded this by mowing lawns in the summer shoveling snow in the winter and doing some people's schoolwork that's actually kind of a cool hustle though Doing people's schoolwork, being that smart to know, that's kind of wild. Anyway, lock in. 15 years old. What do you guys think? I also need to make sure I'm watching my phone. That case, dad calls. Text me. I love the room. The room is decorated really nice. You know what I'm saying? Good personality. You know, it's 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 a nice chill room, I think. The setup is pretty nice too. The only thing I'd recommend is some monitor mounts, maybe, if you can uh, afford them or anything. Just getting like two individual mounts. They're like 30 bucks on Amazon a piece. You just mount it to the desk, you clamp your monitor to it, and bam, you're like set. Um, it would it would give off um some of this room off the desk too. That way you'd be able to do that. Um but yeah, what do you guys think? Love the shelf above the setup. I think it's really clean. I think the only thing it does look is a little bare on the walls here. You know, on this side and stuff. Maybe get a tall plant. Maybe get some more things like that. But overall, very, very clean. Love it. Love to see it. Chat, what do you guys think out of 10? I give it like a solid 7 out of 10. I like it. Clean setup. Allison setup's clean. All right, bro. All right. Wait, hold on. Lock in. All right, all right. What is this, dude? What is this? Thank you for being inspired by me. All right, what is going on? Bro decided to send me a video, a TikTok, of his setup, dude. Like, all right. I appreciate you being inspired by me, but like, I can't even see what's going on here. Like, it's, <laughs> that's that's wild, dude. That's that's just wild. All right, I give your setup like a solid seven. I can't really do anything about it. So, all right, lock in. Oh, There's only three pictures. Oh my, looks clean too, dude. Oh my, bro, bro, dude. <laughs> Okay, here's a better submission. Lock in. I don't know how close my dad is, so I'm trying to, like, get in between so I don't get interrupted. All right, lock in. This is Harvey, a 14-year-old out of England. Their main game is Fortnite, COD, and Rainbow Six Siege. They built a setup to play games with friends after school and at the weekends, and it took them around one year to build their entire setup. And they're still improving it every day. They afforded, for, they afforded their setup from birthdays, Christmas, doing jobs around the house, and their parents got them some stuff for it as well. They built the setup all by himself, and here are some of the things they use. Damn. Okay, you can't you can't lie. I was one take Drake. Right there. I was kind of crazy with it. The room is a vibe. The room is a vibe for sure. Like the the room itself is a vibe. I love the light lighting, the rock wall is clean. I love um yeah, the cars and stuff like that. What is with these people having these big cars like this? We've had two setups now that have had it in this episode. Um, but I, I really love the blue theme. Um, console setup's very clean, you know, very run-of-the-mill, just PS5, you know, monitor, the Amazon Echo, really clean. Keyboard and mouse combos clean as well. 
The chair is kind of low. I I agree. What's going on with that chair, dude? The chair is kind of low like that. <laughs> wait, wait, hold on. <laughs> what is bro doing? Okay, hold up. My dad's pulling up. One second, chat. You guys can talk amongst yourself. One second. I'm muting my mic. Sorry about that, chat. Chad, we're back. Sorry, boys. All right, lock back in. We're good. Sorry, Papa Gus needed uh, needed uh, something from me. All right, lock in. The chair is kind of small. I do think he does need a bigger chair for sure. Um, the cable managing, you know, is pretty solid actually, not for the most part. I would like to see the this mounted behind the Alex Shore if possible, but if not, don't worry about it. Um, yeah, what do you guys think about this over overall? The room's a vibe. I can't lie. The chair, you might need a bigger one for sure. Um, yeah, it's, it's not bad. Six W. I would give it a solid. I want to give it a solid 6.5. Decently looking setup there. All right. Did he just text me now? All right, lock in. This is Minhaz, a 16 year old from Bangladesh, and they are a student in the 10th grade. They made this game. They made this gaming setup for con gaming. Blah, 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 blah. They made this gaming setup for gaming and consecration, and their main games are Valorant, Minecraft, Forza Horizon, and GTA. They took them around two months to build this entire setup and they got they got the setup by getting good grades and EID money that my dad helped as well. Here are some of the specs and they're going to move to another place soon. So that's why I didn't put any effort in the setup. Sorry for the picture quality. My phone is shit. All right. What do you guys think about this? Kale Manage is not bad. It's not bad. It's not insane, but it's like, you know, it's just kind of run of the mill. Two monitor, gaming setup, PC. Very chill. He's going to move soon. Yeah, he's probably just like, you know, on the way out. You know what I mean? I'd say it's like a solid six or seven. But I will say something I noticed, chat. I noticed something that I've never seen anybody do. All right. He put his bezel on the top. I think this is revolutionary. What do you guys think about this? Do you guys think this is actually worth it? Because I wonder, I wonder if it actually does like, like make a difference. Because like, I don't really notice the bezel here, but maybe like the bezel up top would be less noticeable. That low, you know what? I'm going to hold on to that. that. That might be a good idea. I might try it out. Especially if you do like, especially if you do bezel to bezel though, like imagine you did like, I don't know, maybe not. It's more clean though. Yeah, it might be. Like imagine you had the top monitor just perfectly over your, like say you had another monitor right here, right? And you flip the bezel upside down. So the bezels up top and you have the other top bezel, like just rust right above this. I don't know. It might be interesting. Cable manage is pretty good though. Um, yeah. What do you guys think? 
out of 10. I think it's very clean. Yo, wait, actually, stars, that's a good idea. A light bar right here? Oh, that would be fire. Wait, that's a good idea. Anyway, thank you guys for submitting. Appreciate that. We'll move on. That's kind of a fire idea, bro. All right. What is this, dude? What is that? All right. All right. <laughs> All right. All right. We'll save that for another episode. We'll save that for another episode. This is Rowan. I'm going to say Rowan. This is Rowan, a 14-year-old out of the Netherlands. They go to school still, but they don't work, and they built this gaming setup for gaming, obviously. Their main games are Fortnite and FIFA, and the setup took them around three years to build this entire thing. Um, they got inspired by you, or which is me, and TechSource, and they did most of the setup by themselves. You know what I just realized? I wasn't recording this entire time, bro. That's real fucking fun. Oh my. Dude. Party foul, dude. Can't you use the VOD? VODs from you two suck. All right. All right. We're going to start the recording now, which blows. But actually, you know what? I'll just let them use the whole VOD. Fuck it. That's just, that's crazy. Unless you guys thought to download VODs better. That's, that's wild. All right. Lock in. Oh my god. I, I told myself to remind I told myself to remind myself too and I forgot, dude. Oh my. God, I love it. Anyway, lock in. This setup looks pretty good. It happens, brother. I know, dude. Oh, dude, it sucks. All right, I'm recording now. All right. Looking at this setup, I mean, it's pretty clean. I really love the fact that like Dude, this is actually mad nice. The shelving, everything, like it fits super nice. You know what I mean? It's awkward, like it's not symmetrical, but it feels abstract enough to like fit. You know, like I feel like the three dots here look clean. Like the three shelves look clean here. And then he's got like a longer shelf and another shelf. And then the light kind of fits in between with also the pegboard being there. The only thing I would have said is to have a, a white pegboard because everything else is white. But I guess it doesn't really matter. Um, I do love the PC too. I think it's really clean. Cable management's on point for sure. Yeah, the pan dude, this personality, everything is clean, dude. Monitors are mounted pretty well. The uh, the microphone's mounted in a good place. I'd say this is a 10. Honestly, really solid setup, dude. Like, personality through and through, functionality, it's functional. It, it fits in the setup. He did a really nice uh, way of decorating it. I would honestly give this a 10. What do you guys think? I, I I genuinely think this is a 10. Very, very clean. Love it, actually. I love the vibe of the setup for sure. Thank you for submitting, man. That's insane. That's a really nice setup. All right. All right. Love these images, man. Love them. Uh, this is uh, Sion from Australia. He's a 13-year-old, and his main games are Fortnite and Call of Duty Marvel Warfare 3. He built the setup to play games with friends, and it took him around three years to build, and he's still upgrading it as of now. He forwarded it by saving Christmas and birthday money, and let's take a look at his setup. I, really, I You know what? It's honestly kind of nice. You know the pictures aren't the best. I mean, it, it's honestly kind of nice. I, 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 look how small you got a 13 by 11 looks really clean um no but th i think this is the first time i've seen a 13 by 11 mouse pad in somebody's setup in a while it's been a while since i've seen someone that bought one um but looking at the setup i mean i really love the um 
the the shelves up top i think the posters are pretty clean i wish i would have seen what exactly they look like or what they are oh berserk i don't know what this one is and bleach okay bleach and berserk is kind of a w um i do love the controller mount thing here i do like uh the you know the mouse pad and keyboard combo the mic arm has been perfect position i think love the little iron man guy what do you guys think about this? The keyboard being vertical is already a, a telltale time he plays Fortnite, man. Keyboard's fire too, though. Yeah, keyboard and mouse combo is pretty clean. Yeah, overall, very, very clean, dude. For 13, nice setup, dude. Nice console setup, actually. It's, like, decorated nice. It's, like, taken care of, you know? Um, So... I need to submit picks one day. I have a decent setup. I know, bitch, if I have heard. I've seen your TikTok, you know? I definitely think um, I definitely think you should. Wire manager is hopeless. All right. All right. Bro didn't even give me any sort of info to rock with. Chat, I'll give you the opportunity. Yes or no? Bro's a fan. All right. Dude, I, dude, I get called a part-time streamer. I get called a fan, like... <laughs> yes react to this i'm just messing with you pinch by just messing with you bro's making excuses all right <laughs> i'm a fan of you nah, nah no okay everyone's saying no on that one okay we'll, we'll rock with this one This is um, Oscar. We're going to start with Oscar. <clears throat> this is Oscar, a 14-year-old from Denmark, and he mainly uses this setup for gaming and schoolwork. It took him around a month to build, and he built this setup by himself, and his main games are Valorant, Fortnite, and GTA. He's getting a new headset with a white boom arm soon, and his birthday and chore money afforded him this setup, and let's get into it. He doesn't know any spe specs on the PC, so we don't have those, but we'll lock in and see what we got. Lock in. You know what, man? It's honestly not that bad. Kale Manchin's not bad either. It's not even that bad. The room is a vibe, though. The room is a vibe. I like this. Definitely should put something here on the wall for sure. Hey, wait, that's me. <laughs> I can lip writer. I can lip read better than you. Turn your cam off. All right. Somebody ban that guy. Somebody ban that guy. Anyway, um, <laughs> looking at this, though, overall, I really do like the setup. I think um, overall, it's kind of a vibe. I like the room you're in, too. I think the room is clean as well. Um, it's kind of dope that I'm there. That's cool. Um, but yeah. What do you guys think about the setup? I think he does need a new mouse pad for sure. Um, but yeah, the room in, is a vibe, dude. Love this little shelf. Above here and more lighting. I would say more lighting for sure. Lighting, maybe some more greenery, like some fake plants and stuff. But overall, this is kind of a vibe. I love the windows right here for sure. So thank you for submitting. For, for 14, that's really clean. All right, Philip. All right. This is Philip, a 13 year old out of Toronto, uh, uh, Toronto, Canada. It's technically Canada. This is. I'm going to restart that. Sorry, guys. <clears throat> this is Philip, a 13-year-old from Toronto, Canada, and they mainly play Fortnite, Roblox, and FC24. They built their, they built the setup to play games with their friends and family, and it took them around two years to build everything you see in the setup. They forwarded this setup for my allowance and their birthday money. And they did most of the setup by themselves, but their mom did help them a little bit. Cool. 
W mom. Lock in. Underneath the bed setups, I think are so clean, dude. Like underneath, like, like this type of thing, it's just really clean when they have it when it's done right. Um, Xbox clean setup, I definitely agree. The laptop's kind of clean too. Overall, I would definitely recommend to maybe raise his monitor up or something just because it's like right on the desk, you know, um, maybe like mount it or anything. But I would declutter the desk too. like a lot of this stuff can go in the drawer down here. You know what I mean? Um, it just seems like there's a lot going on. And then I would also cable manage this if you can. I see you tried a little bit here, but maybe just putting a raceway like right here, you know, underneath the desk and just putting all these cables in it just to hide it would be probably better. Um overall i mean it's not bad i do like the the idea i think the idea is there but it does need a, a little bit of decluttering and um reorganization and it will become a little bit better maybe a little poster here yeah it'd be kind of clean too but i give this like a solid i give it like a solid six i'd say six seven ish pretty clean i give it a six It's actually not bad. I'm right, moving on from that one. He doesn't have enough info there. No info at all. All right. All right. Now we got some info here. Lock in. This is Dark Side. Or actually, we'll do his Harry. We'll use Harry as his name. This is Harry, a 13 year old, and Brisbane. Brisbane. Okay, I'll do it one more time. This is Harry, a 13 year old out of Brisbane, and his setup is in a living room because of lack of space. This chair is also the one that gets really hot in here as well. He's a 13 year old and his main, wait, he, he, oh my, dude, my brain is fried from this submission, bro. My brain is fried from this submission. Just put it in the order I say, man. Holy shit. Anyway, lock in. Jesus, dude. All right. This is Harry, a 13 year old out of Brisbane, Australia. His main games are Red Dead Redemption 2, Fortnite, Valorant, Minecraft, and F1 23. He built the setup to chill, have fun, and also flex on friends. Okay, that's weird. Um, also, it took him around two years to build the setup, and he's constantly upgrading it over time. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, let's take a look. I kind of botched that first intro, but it's okay. What do you guys think about this? <clears throat> I do like I do like how he placed the monitors. I think that this one needs to come up a little bit just to be the same height as this. Um to make it like a little bit more, you know, a little bit more you know, symmetrical basically. Um I think that he should try to kill manage this a little bit more as well. I mean, the signum rack works, but some of the cables that like go in between the monitors and stuff like that trying to hide those would be good. Um I definitely think a new mount for this monitor or something or make them the same height would really work. Um I also do like the little personality you have here. Um but I don't I don't get why you're flexing on friends with this setup, man. There's really not anything crazy about it, you know. It's just Two monitor setup, Ikea, Alex Shores, and, you know, a nice little shelf. But I do think you should um, add some more personality um, once you have room to. Um, but yeah, overall, it's not bad. Chat, what do you guys think out of 10, though? I think I think it's like a solid six. It's got a good foundation. It could be a little better once they upgrade whatever they're trying to upgrade. Um, but yeah, overall, it's really nice. Five, five, three. Damn. Thank you for spinning. All right. 
I just got to get out of here. This is Thomas. Um, this is Thomas. He's a 13 year old out of Maryland and he's been working on this setup for about three years. He goes to school and he also does a dropshipping business and his main game is Fortnite, but he got hardware banned, so he can't play anymore. Uh, his PC is the Player 2 Prime from NZXT and the keyboard is an Opal high ground keyboard and he's running SG Pro Superlight as well. He mostly built this setup by himself, but his older brother and dad would help uh, build some stuff like the Alex drawers, etc. All right, take a look. Take a look at this. Honestly? Honestly, this is pretty clean. Yo, this is actually mad nice. PC's clean. Chat, what do you guys think about this? Now, this is actually mad nice. I love the monitor layout. I love the functionality of the setup. It's a bit bare, so I would love to see a shelf in between this. Like, like you kind of already cut the, the triangles for it, so I'd love to see some sort of shelf or something here. Um, but I do love how you did this. I mean, it, the monitors are laid out really nice. Um, very, very clean. I do love, I do love the, uh, how you innovated like the little cable here, just to duct tape it so you could like plug it in whenever you need to. Very, very clean. Maybe a poster. Yeah. Maybe some lighting, something like that. Overall, I would recommend... I mean, there's not really much I can recommend with this setup. I just love the layout. I think you're doing a good job with the color scheme so far. And um, yeah, it's a great setup. I'd probably give this like a solid. I'm going to give it a solid 7.5 out of 10. It's kind of clean. 13 years old, though, is pretty nice. Worst 13-year-old setup. Trust me, I've seen worse. All right, we're going to skip that one for now. We have a bad episode coming up. This is Robin, a 13-year-old from Sweden, and their main game is Minecraft, Fortnite, Overwatch, and Siege. They've been building this setup all by themselves for about four years. They got a PC, um, AOC monitor for Christmas, and everything else on their birthday. They bought the LED lights for myself for cheap prices on Amazon, and they built the setup for gaming and just focusing on more schoolwork. Um, all right, bet. Let's take a look. Ooh! Wait, this is actually kind of nice. The room is mad, mad nice. This is actually mad nice. Mad, mad nice. The setup's pretty clean. Cable management. Why is there a HyperX mic in your cable management, buddy? What What is it doing there? Like... I mean, I guess that's where it belongs, kind of. But like, like, what is going on, dude? But like, uh, all right, all right. Is his monitor resting on the chair? All right. That's crazy. That's crazy. Overall, the room is a nice vibe. Like, looking at this image, I'm very impressed with the setup. And then I look at it, actually. Like, what's going on here? <laughs> but overall, I would recommend maybe some cable management. Um, like, it's not bad. I mean, I'm sure you play Fortnite just fine on it. But I would love to see more cable management. So maybe some a bigger desk, maybe, or something. That way you could um, take the PC off the desk. Um, yeah, overall, it's not bad. I would probably say the color scheme is like a solid eight. I love your color scheme, but your setup itself, I'd probably say it's like a six. The room is a vibe, but the setup is like, what's going on here? Um, I would give it like a solid six. Really clean. Yeah, definitely get a monitor arm for sure. I love the vibe though. Oh, dang. All right, lock in. <clears throat> Thank you guys for all the follows on TikTok, by the way. Appreciate y'all. Uh, if you guys are new to the channel on, on YouTube, make sure to subscribe. Appreciate you guys. Do set up reactions every Saturday slash Sunday. Um, 
I try to get both of them done, but I also post videos and all that kinds of stuff. So appreciate y'all lock in. This is Diesel, a 14 year old from Canada and a student in the eighth grade. They made set up. They made this setup to watch YouTube for and for gaming because they hated on. Blah, 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 blah. They made this setup for watching YouTube and gaming because they hated playing on an Xbox One S and they were only getting 60 FPS, so they decided to buy a PC. Their main games are Fortnite, Minecraft, Valorant, and many more. They started building this setup at the start of 2020 and they just built a new PC because their setup isn't finished and they always want to add more. They got the setup by shoveling snow in the winter, mowing lawns in the summer, and they built it all by themselves. Say less. Let's take a look. Ooh. Wait. Whoa, flawless cable management. Wait, we love this. We like this. We like this a lot. This is very clean. PC's very clean. Wait, this is really nice. The room is nice too. Dude, he's got a nice Funko Pop collection. Dang, man. The room's a vibe. The room is actually a vibe. I love this. Too much red? No, I love this, man. This is awesome. I think this is an amazing setup. I really like this. The KO Mansion's beautiful. The lighting's great. You know, honestly, this is a very clean setup. I love the personality throughout the room and everything. Oh, he's got a mini fridge too, bro. Dude, this is a dude. This is a vibe, though. You guys can't lie. You would love to wake up and play some games here, dude. You guys can't lie. Like, you would love to just wake up, grab a drink from your mini fridge, hop into your gaming chair, and just play games with your friends. Like, you can't lie. That's like a, ba a baller ass experience. Um, overall, though, I do think that um, there could be a little bit less red, obviously, like chat saying, but I don't think it's that bad. I think you're doing a great job with it. Um, the personality's on point. Um, and yeah. I would give it a solid. I'm going to give it a solid 7.5 out of 10. I like this a lot. I also would recommend a raceway for your TV, but that's really it. Very, very clean. All right, boys, lock in. We got a lot of good setups going in a row here. We got a good, we got a good little, we got a good little thing going. This is Jacob, a ninth grader from Louisiana. Um, their main games are Fortnite, Siege, and CSGO, and they built this setup for them to get off their old PS4. They wanted a really big change, so they saved up for two and a half years, and then they built this entire setup to what it is today. They afforded this setup by cutting lawns, washing cars for a whole year, and till this day, they still have brought a lot of money from it. It's really easy to get a lot of support from my family and neighbors. Their dad helped them build the setup as well, and let's take a look at the setup. Sheesh! All right, this is nice. This is nice. Looking at the, the desk, love the L-shaped desk. Kale Mansion could be a little bit more tidy, but you know what? It works. PC is nice as well. I love the color scheme in the PC. Very, very clean. I also love, um, I also love the lighting behind the monitor. I think that adds such a nice depth to it. I would recommend maybe a better stand to ri raise his monitor up and like tilt it to where it's like straight, you know? But other than that, the setup is very, very clean, dude. Like I'm really impressed for, for how young you are, you know? Very clean, very minimal, very chill. I would say that there should be more personality through the right side of the setup, you know? Um, But other than that, it's really, really clean. What would you guys rate this? I'd rate this like a solid, I'd say a solid nine for his age and like what he's building functionality clean. Yeah. Solid nine. Yeah. Landon, I saw your message. Thank you, bro. Appreciate that. Much love. I can't wait to see your setup, bro. All right. This is nice too. This is sick. Uh, wait, hold on. We're going to use Evans as his name here. This is Evans, a 16-year-old out of Minnesota, and he works for a bar busing tables. His main games are GTA 5, Call of Duty, and 2K, and he built a setup to have somewhere to sit back and relax and play some games. 
took him around two years to get the setup where it is now and he has a bunch of things in his setup obviously um and let's check it out let's take a look dude i like this like this is really nice kill management somewhat on point not too bad Dude, I have one of these. I want to use it in my room, my my setup too. Super clean. Head headset stands clean too. The shelves are nice. Nice controller holder. Love that. Keyboard and mouse combos clean. Yeah, this is a very nice setup, dude. Very chill and relaxed. Like, love the katana. Love that. Dude, honestly, like such an insane little clean setup. I mean, it's not like over the top, right? Subtle personality. The shelves work. They're clean. The desk is clean and nice. What do you guys think about this? Yeah, I would give it a solid like 8.5. Super, super clean. Maybe a 9 actually. Yeah, I'd say, I would say a 9. I give a 9. Very, very clean. I love that, dude. That, that, that setup is very clean. I didn't have much to say on it, but it's so clean. All right, just one picture, dude. Thank you for supporting the mouse head business, but come on, man. Come on, dude. All right. Okay. We only have like three pictures to go off of, but I really want to see his setup because this looks insane. This is... uh. Fear me Glock 1. He's a ninth grader living in Florida and his main games are Valorant and Siege. He afforded this gaming setup by selling stocks and reselling sneakers and betting on football games. Hey, uh, sorry to tell you, but if you're in ninth, ninth grade, brother, you're not betting on football games. And if you are, you're doing it illegally. Anyway, <laughs> instead, I took him around three days to build and he built it all by himself. And let's take a look at my boy's setup. Bros is worse snitch. All right. All right. Hypothetically. <laughs> what do you guys think about this? This is actually so clear. I mean, hey, man, he must be betting good if he's getting a PC like that, dude. Like, that's insane. Like, look at the PC, dude. That's insane. The setup itself is actually super, super nice. Um, I love the the way that you built like the two shelves next to each other to highlight each thing beautiful i might use this idea i love this actually a lot i love how you did like the lighting right above each one i love this it's so cool um i also do think you should mount your monitor your main monitor because you know um the main monitor does feel like a little off you know um i would say to mount it like through a mount or mount it to the wall or whatever um, it'll make it super clean as well. Also, love you using the final mouse. Uh, I think that's a... I don't even know what final mouse that is, but high ground keyboard's clean. Also, thank you for supporting the mouse pad business. Appreciate you. But yeah, this is really, really clean, dude. I love this. Um, I would give this a solid 8 out of 10. 9 out of 10, actually. No, I would give it a 9, dude. Honestly, super clean setup. I love the personality and how they're displayed. I love that. Super, super clean, dude. Cool ideas. Very, very good setup. Finally, a real gutsy Aiden mousepad. That's what I'm saying, dude. We've already seen this guy. Ryan's posted like 25 times now. This We saw him four times at the same stream. All right. <sighs> Chad, I'll give you the opportunity. Yes or no? Are you reacting to this? <sighs> yes, you guys want to see it. All right. This is Adam. This is Adam, a 13 year old out of Denmark, and he goes to school still. He's a main, his, his main games is Minecraft and Roblox, and he has something. Oh my God, I can't even talk. His main games are Minecraft and Roblox, and he built the setup to have something to do in his free time, like play some games or whatever. It took him around two and a half years uh, to build this setup, and. He afforded this setup through rich grandparents. All right, dude. Rich grandparents and saving up from birthdays. Gotcha. 
he built the whole setup by himself and let's take a look at his setup here i gotta sneeze <laughs> ah, shit sorry lock in I need to stand for a second. I'm gonna pass out. Ugh, all right. All right. Chat, what's your favorite ice cream go? Bless me. Thank you. Thank you. Daddy's money, grandparents' money. <laughs> all right. All right. Looking at the setup. Oreo. All right. <clears throat> looking at the setup though i do have two questions why is this monitor on the bottom because i think it would almost look better if you had one of these main monitors at the bottom and then you did like side by side or something or have these flipped it might look a little better but um or just get another sell both these monitors and get one of these you know what i mean um but overall the setup itself is very clean i love the uh the, where the pc's placed i think you did a great job with that um the shelves and the lego builds are insane by the way i think those are legos maybe i'm maybe i'm wrong but it's really clean bro the minecraft bed sheets yo 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 minecraft bed sheets are fire those are fire those legos are kind of cool too but the setup is super clean w sheets that's what i'm saying Kale Manjit's okay, you know, could could be a little better, but not not insane. Um, the PC setup is actually it seems super out of place, right? Like it seems like this room is like like all kid friendly, you know, like very young kid, you know, and then you turn around and you see this. You see like a nice ass setup in here, you know. Uh the only thing I would have recommended is to maybe use a white desk just because of all the other white things in your room. But overall, it's not bad. I think um, you should sell both these smaller monitors and get another one of your big your big monitor just so it looks like pretty symmetrical. Um, but not too bad. Not too bad. Nice little calm gaming setup for a younger kid, man. It's not, not bad. 13 years old, pretty clean. We've seen Brayden set, Bray set up before. I think he resubmitted. 10 year old setup ten years old man as he subscribed he subscribed with notifications on you know what honestly w you know what 10 out of 10 10 out of 10 setup dude no nah, that's cursed all right he subscribed chat you can't get mad at him <laughs> bro the pc that the pc on the floor says it all dude ohio ass setup all right bro's mouse pad is the pc All right, this is Sushi, a 16-year-old out of Nebraska, and their main occupation is Chick-fil-A. They Their main games are Fortnite and Valorant, and they built their setup to edit videos, play games, and do college and schoolwork. Um, it took around two years to build their entire setup, and here are some of the things in their setup here. Let's take a look at their setup. Wait, he's kind of cooking. It's What if it's Sunday? He's not working, I guess. Speaking of, I better get Chick-fil-A today. I'm going to miss out. I don't tomorrow. What are you guys thinking about this? I love the Highway 40, dude. One of the best cases out, bro. I might switch all my PCs to the Highway 40. I love it. Looking at this setup, though, I really think it's clean. I think you could declutter the desk a little bit. Just because there seems like a lot of stuff on this side. But overall, I do like your little shelves up here. The monitor layout's pretty clean. Kale management looks like it could be a little better down here. I can see them, you know. Um, what do you guys think? A bigger mouse pad would be fire. I agree. <coughs> <Got eaten. coughs> Sorry, guys. I had something in my, uh, my chest. 
Um, but overall, very, very clean. Yeah, overall, very, very clean setup. I'd probably rate this a solid 7 out of 10. Very, very clean. The high Y60, Y70, all that's really clean. All right. All right. Getting blown up right now. Sorry, guys. Hold on. Nine years old. How are you not banned from the Discord? Bros nine. Bros nine. All right, lock in. Back to the setup. This is Henry, a nine year old from New York. His inspiration is Tech Source and me. And he got it from his dad's uh he got help from his dad and friends he got the money from birthdays christmases and chores and he forgot the specs and his main games are fortnite and roblox he built the setup because he wanted to play games with friends that he thought it would be cool what do you guys think bro's got a bear brick at nine years old man look at the priorities <laughs> yo set up low-key insane 10 out of 10. Honestly, for nine years old, this is pretty crazy, dude. I didn't even have an X. I had I had a Nintendo DS at nine years old. That's how old I am, chat. I had the Nintendo DS. That's all I had at nine. Like, you know, I'm old, but like that was a shit back then, dude. Um, but yeah, overall, this is not bad. I would. What would you guys rate this? Dude, he's got like like panels and everything, dude. I would give this a solid. I would give this like a solid seven out of ten. For nine years old, this is not bad at all. I wish he gave me better pictures, but yeah, that's crazy. Dude, I be you know what's crazy? Chat, how many of how many of y'all? How many of y'all are from Australia? Dude, I've had a crazy dude. I have I have had so many uh Australian people come into my streams recently. Like I don't know what it is. Dude, Australia is like like taking over my streams. How like see look at this. Me, 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 I'm from Australia. Like dude, look this is what I'm saying. There's so many of y'all from Australia, dude. I swear I have so many Australian people in my streams recently. Like what time is it for you guys? Isn't it like tomorrow? Like <laughs> All right, lock in. Uh, this is Jed, a uh, high school student out of Australia. <laughs> their main game is Fortnite and Rocket League, and it's taken around two to three years to build their entire setup. Uh, they afforded the setup from sponsors, birthday money, Chris's money, and their own money, and their family helped them with their setup. All right, let's take a look. Let's take a look. You know what? Okay, my question is, why is there a slit in the middle of the desk? Like, he mounted this here, right? But why, why is it there? You know what I'm saying? It, it seems like the PC is super out of place. Um, like looking at this, like I let, the cables aren't fine. It, I think it's just because the desk is. But like, why is the PC there? I think it could be better, like you know, either on the floor or something. Because it doesn't really make sense to put it on the desk in this case, but I don't know. What do you guys think? I definitely think you should add like a monitor mount and maybe change up the mount where this this mic mount is um, and maybe a better desk overall, but it's kind of clean. It's kind of clean. I think the desk is the problem. See, I don't understand why these desk manufacturers do like do this. You know what I'm saying? They do stuff like this, which is super weird. Like why, why have all these cables like in this grate that you just throw it in there? It's like, it still looks bad regardless. You know what I mean? Like, but overall it's not bad. I'd probably rate this like a solid six. I think there should be more personality throughout the room. Like it seems like there's just like some random thing up top. Um, but overall I would definitely I would definitely work on some personality in the setup for sure. 
um, and some reorganization of the setup as well. Pretty good, pretty good setup though. This is Aqua, a third, or I'm going to do Mitch. <clears throat> this is Mitch, a 13 year old from Australia and their main, their main games are Valorant and Fortnite. Uh, they go to school in year eight to make money. And they also, they go to school and to make money, they do cat sitting with their mom and DoorDash. Okay. Cat sitting for DoorDash. All right. It doesn't make any sense. I think he's doing DoorDash and the cat sitting. All right. Um, it took him around a few years to get all the money for it. And he started building a new desk. He's starting to build a new desk soon. He afforded this from doing DoorDash, chores, cat sitting, extra birthdays, and Christmas money. He built this setup all by himself, but his parents did help him with buying the PC and going halves for the money. Subscribe to Gutsy Aiden. <clears throat> Subscribe to Gutsy Aiden, ladies and gentlemen. If you're not subscribed, you're a loser. All right. Lock in. <sighs> Honestly, pretty clean. Dude, I, I don't know why you, yeah, like, you know what's crazy? I don't know why people hate on one monitor setups, dude. I love just being able to kick on a one monitor setup and just play some games, dude. Like, I love this type of, like, vibe here. Very, very clean, you know? Um, nice little budget, clean setup. You know, it works. It's functional. Um, Kale Mansion could be a little better, obviously, but not a huge, hum humongous deal. Um... I think I saw one where it was zoomed out more. I don't know, but the, there should be more personality throughout the room. I can't really see much about it, but um, the setup itself is functional and nice. Um, super clean. Um, yeah, overall, I would say it was a, I would, I would give this like a solid seven out of 10. Honestly, really, really clean. One monitor setup, you know, Run of the mill PC, keyboard, mouse, chair, all that looks very, very nice though. Super, super clean. Uh, I'm nowhere near 30 yet, but I feel like it seems like these you these new young kids are putting older kids to shame with these desk setups. These 14 year old setups be lit as fuck compared to some 20 year 21 year olds sometimes. Yeah, I, I agree. I think a lot of the younger generation, what especially in my Discord, watch my channel and they work toward improving their setup a lot more than they you know than normal people do because a lot of older people are kind of just like okay with it they're like whatever like it's just whatever but a lot of these younger kids are trying to use their setup to then achieve cool things and then you know i think that's something that's a lot different with my channel is i try to inspire a lot of people like chat how many of y'all have watched one of my videos and went and like bought something for your setup or like upgraded your setup or like rearranged it just to like do it you know like that's that's like what I want my channel to inspire people to do, you know? Like that's Yeah, see like I like this is what I like though. Um I like to see that people are inspired by me to like improve their room and stuff. That's like that's the whole goal. That's why also the mouse pad business, the mouse pad business works so well with you guys. It's cuz like if you guys don't even do that at the bare minimum, you guys could just buy a mouse pad and upgrade your entire desk, you know? Like Especially from the designs and stuff like that and how it fits in your guys' setups, like, you know, um, it's pretty it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. I love my job. <laughs> anyway, lock in. Um we'll do we'll do this guy's setup real quick. There's not a lot of info, so we'll go through it real quick. Um this is Bargav. He's basically He's basically from India, and this is a setup that took him four years to get to now. He basically uses this setup to play games, Valorant, GTA 5, and Shrouded, etc. And he hopes the chat likes it. Me too. You also introduced me to the 3D art wall concept. Thank you. Appreciate that. All right, lock in. This is pretty clean. Little clean laptop setup, you know, is actually not bad. I love the lighting between the shelves. I think this is really cool. And I also like how you like separated them, you know, like you, the symmetry is also there. Like it's symmetrical, but it's also abstract. Cause like, if you look at this, like, you know, the, mo it still goes in between the monitors and the plants are both symmetrical, but then the shelves are at different heights. So it creates this like really, really nice vibe to it. Um, also do like that you mounted the laptop to a stand. I think that's one of the biggest things you can do for a laptop setup. Like 
if you want to use it just mount it to a stand and make it look clean like that um also the main monitor is very very clean um yeah i would recommend a bigger mouse pad though it does seem like this is kind of like eh um but yeah overall very very clean i love the posters on the wall too what do you guys think about this the red is a little bit jarring but i think it does fit in the setup very well i give it like a solid eight oh all right This is Tom, a 14-year-old from England, and he goes to school in ninth or in eighth grade. Subscribe to Gutsy Aiden. I'm being held captive to say this. Eight. All right, dude. All right. All right. His main games are Fortnite, BND Drive, Euro Truck Simulator 2. Um, and he started getting he started getting recommended tech videos, so he just looked it up and tried to make his setup look better and better. Um, he built a setup to have a good place to chill outside and um, outside of sports. So he's basically like you know chilling. Um, he afforded this setup from doing chores, walking dogs, car washing, and he earned 50% of the price of his PC and sold the Xbox for the rest. Cool. Let's take a look. Lock in. Okay, the cat's really cute, but he's also angry. Angry boy. Okay, cable management from the bottom down looks really, really clean. Like, you can't see, like, a single cable in sight. Also love how the desk is mounted to the wall. I think that's really unique. Keyboard and mouse combo is not the best, but you know, it works. Kale management's a, a little bit there. The shelf is clean too. I'm trying to figure out what this AIO cooler is. Anyway, um, PC looks pretty nice. What do you guys think about this? I definitely think the first thing that he could do to improve this is... Um, mount the monitor to the desk somehow just to clean up you know the stand i mean it doesn't really matter yet until you get a bigger mouse pad but overall it's not bad really clean setup dude um i love the personality in it you could add a little bit more maybe add some more shelves and stuff but it's not vesa compatible okay so if it's not then i'd get another monitor and mount it because at least for now it works um but what do you guys think about this out of 10 Love the theme though. Yeah, I love the blue and black theme. I think it's great. I think it just needs a little bit more attention to detail, like the mouse pad and then the like the monitor monitors and all that. Uh, yeah, I would give it like a solid seven. I think it's pretty good. Solid seven. Thank you, Tom, for submitting. Um, I missed a message. <sighs> I'm here in Switzerland. I'm new here and I'm from Switzerland. It's 10.43 p.m. What time is it for me? Um, I think it's 104 or 147. It's 147. Jesus. My brain is not working today, man. My brain is not working today. How is it with working with Nadia? Oh, it's pretty okay. She's all right. That was the first time ever meeting her. She's pretty cool. What's, what's the best mouse you suggest? Okay, it depends on what your budget is, you know? All right, we're going to do this last setup. We're going to do this last setup and then I'll answer some questions. All right, guys. We'll do this last setup and then we'll we'll lock in on some questions. All right, lock in. Um, This is Matt. Uh, he's a 15 year old out of the UK. Um, What he does for work is he does a paper round, which he's been doing for the last couple of months. Paper round. What is that? Can anybody in the UK tell me what a paper round is? Is that like newspapers? Or something um his main game is fortnite minecraft and modern warfare and he built the setup because he wanted because he wanted to upgrade from a crappy xbox and it took him around four to five months to build this entire setup um he afforded this from a paper round and my mom helped me pay for the case and cpu and he did everything on his own to build the setup delivering newspapers like local news oh gotcha gotcha so i'm not i'm not from the uk i don't know bro i don't know bro all right, look in, let's look into this. Down to the paper round. <laughs> All right. Ultra wide monitor, PC looks clean. 
the whale is kind of cool on the wall. You know, honestly, it's pretty chill. I would say I would say the coolest thing about the setup is that like the vibe it has, like the candles on point for sure. Candles are on point. Uh, I like that the like the vibe of the setup. The only thing I would recommend is it seems like you're kind of cluttered. Like I would almost put the PC over here on the side desk and um, figure that out because it seems like it seems like the PC is kind of out of place here and it seems like it's kind of like walling you in. So, or take a shelf out of this and put the PC down here, you know? Um, but yeah, what do you guys think about this? It seems a little cramped though, for sure, right? Really solid? Yeah, I like it. I really like it too. Yeah, I'd give it like a solid, um, I'm gonna give it a solid seven. Anyway, that's a pretty solid, uh, a pretty solid, uh, little setup react there. Let's go back to the talking screen. All right, I'll answer some questions real quick too. Um, let me end the TikTok live. I'm building a setup. Any tips? Consistency throughout the setup. Good lighting. Uh, stick to a consistent theme and work on a good color scheme. Think about functionality, but also think about uh, personality. You want both. What chair do I use? This is a Mavix M9. Pretty good. Pretty good chair. Um, when what? When is your site restocking mouse pads? Which ones are you asking for in particular? Because a lot of them are in stock right now. Uh, we have a lot of styles in uh, in stock, but a few of them aren't because we've had some issues with them in the past. But we're working on them. Should I do one double stacked monitors or one horizontal and one vertical? Depends on your situation. Uh, in my case, I run an ultra wide up top so I can put all of my streams up and then I run one monitor down below to play games on or react to setups. Um, that's what I like. It's just honestly, it's all preference. You got to try out some stuff. Um, you can also watch some videos on YouTube of like how I come up with like how I decide things. Thank you for the mouse head order, by the way. Um, do you sell keycaps? I do. Um, it's this set right here. Actually, I have both of them on two different keyboards, so I'll just do that. Here's one of them. Here's This is a different space bar, but this is the, one of the sets right here. Here's the Topo set. And here's the, uh, here's the Arctic set. Get them on TikTok shop, or you can get them on uh, YouTube shop, or you can get them on anything. Is $3,000 too much for my first gaming PC? No. If you save up and you know exactly what games you're gonna play and stuff like that, then do that. Like, you know, like you don't wanna, um, you don't wanna like, you know, you wanna make sure that you find the right, like, balance. Like, you wanna be able to use your PC for anything and also be able to run things that you wanna play in the future. You know what I mean? It's all about, like, finding the right balance. Should my friend go with a 4060 Ti, 16 gigs, and a 1400? Um, he mainly plays Fortnite and GTA 5 or a 4060 Ti 8 gig, uh, 7800 X 3D. I would say in your case, the Intel one is probably better because Intel overall, in my opinion, at least what I've seen, the newer Intel chips have been way better for gaming in my, in my specific thing. The Ryzen is better for like streaming and gaming at the same time. It's better for multitasking overall, but like if you're just strictly gaming, Intel is the wave. Um, and that's what I've been that's what I've been using. Intel's been elite. Um, is there a big difference between the 4060 and the 4060 Ti? Not much, but you'll see probably like a 20, 30 FPS increase. You can also check out um, all of that too. I'm um, on YouTube. There's probably people who test that. Um, what's up, Rob Rabar? How you doing? Chat, so what do you guys think? I would say the 1400, the 1400K is good. It's probably better. <clears throat> How much does my mix cost? My mix. Like my audio setup? my mic oh oh uh so my mic right here this is the sure 7 b it's like 350 
my interface is um GoXLR, so I think that was like 500. So it's like 750 bucks or so. But I also I just got a big package from Rode, which I'm going to switch this switch it all up very soon. Um Rode sent me out a massive package, so I have like a new interface, a new mic, um a bunch of other things. They sent me like a bunch of stuff. So, I'm going to check it out here soon. How do you get the tag in your Discord? Once you're on the setup, you just tag it. It literally has a button that you click. Uh, what got me into content creation? TikTok. I just started making videos on my phone. I was making four videos a day. Um, and I started doing well. What type of monitors do I use? Um, okay, you don't have to spam, bro. You don't have to spam. You don't have to spam. I see your message, bro. Chill out. Um... My monitors I use now is like, I use a 540 Hertz main ASUS monitor. I run an LG ultra wide, and then I run a portable monitor right below my camera to look at chat. Um, what CPU for a 2080 super i7, i7 any gen probably be pretty nice. Um, you can find like, you know, a 13 gen i7 for a pretty good price too. Um, 540 hertz is crazy. Yeah, it's awesome. How tall am I? 5'5". Five, five. I have the NZXT Player 1. Should I upgrade to the 350 to the Aeros uh, 4060? You could. You don't have to yet. Uh, I don't stream. Is there any point to getting three a second monitor? The only point you'd ever want to get a second monitor for would be like if you want YouTube up on the same time you're playing something and you want to like glance at it. You know what I mean? Um, then sure. Why did mine get skipped? It either got skipped for a future episode where we're doing like worse setups or something like that, or it got, um, or I didn't have enough info because I tagged the one. Um, do you like the 580 Hertz? Yeah, it's pretty clean. I want to get one that's, I want to get one that's, um, 1440 though. How do you get the tag? You just click the button. There's a button at the bottom that says it. What button to click? Should I buy a boom, a mic boom arm? Are they worth it? Uh, it depends. If, if, you, if your setup like allows for it, it's pretty good. Um, there's ones that go like underneath your monitor, like low pro, or you can get one that kind of like hangs off to the side like this. Um, I used to use a low pro one because it was super nice. But as I got older and as I like started building the setup, I honestly like this mic layout more. It just seems kind of natural to you guys. Like if I didn't have this here, chat, like imagine this was gone. It would it would just look empty. You know what I'm saying? It'd be too empty. So. Why are you not on Twitch right now? Because I stream mainly on YouTube and TikTok. Um Twitch, I'm gonna come back to during the summer. Um, but right now I'm not ready to, to stream on Twitch. I think I wanna I wanna do it right and I'm building up like a social media stuff then um yeah then i'm gonna build up my twitch so you guys should follow it you guys should definitely follow it because then when i come back to streaming like you guys are gonna be able to follow it it's gonna be more gaming and content on there i'm gonna do like more indie games i'm gonna take like the queso and jinxie effect kind of um no you skipped it unless i asked chat and they said they didn't want to react to it that is probably going to get um reacted to later on Reacting to setups, I just reacted to like a bunch. I just did an hour, almost two hours of setups. So I'm done with setups today. Um, do you play any games? Yeah, I play all kinds of stuff. We're gonna do we're gonna do a lot of that on Twitch eventually. Um, I don't think that gaming works on this account, if I'm being completely fair with y'all. I don't think playing games on this account really works. Um, streaming wise. So I'm just doing what works on this account, and then I'm gonna make gaming a priority on other accounts. Like TikTok and stuff like that, and streaming and all that. Um, so 
I'm going to probably do more streaming stuff uh, starting in summer. Uh, do you prefer Windows or Mac? Uh, do you ever consider a hybrid setup? Yeah, I do actually have a hybrid setup, but I have two setups right now. If I'm being completely honest, Mac for productivity, Windows for gaming. For Mac is an elite for, for productivity and getting stuff done. Um, so, yeah. Um, how often do you think you should clean your PC every two to three months? I'd say, uh, do you do VR and what, if, if so, what VR do you use? I have a quest too, but I don't VR much. I don't play VR very much. I don't have time to be fair. I wanted to get the Apple vision pro because that's like productive, but it's like 4,000. I'm not trying to pay for that. Honestly, thoughts on vaping don't do it not worth it what what's the point in vaping dude you know have you guys you know wait what's what's up for delivery oh so that um thing um if you would you rather vape or would you rather make a hundred thousand dollars right that is a lot better than wasting your time vaping you know what i mean what what's the point Dude, would you rather sit down and grind at your fucking dreams or sit there and puff on a dog shit fucking pen? Like, what's the point? Work, work, work for your dreams instead of spending $25 on a vape. What's the point? That comparison is bad. No, it's true. Why, why sit there and vape and do some dog shit when, and get addicted to nicotine when you could go around and actually be, achieve your dreams, work hard at them every day, and be a very productive human being? You know what I'm saying? Like, why, why sit there and puff on some dog shit? You know what I mean? No point. When's Snow Swirl coming back? Uh, very soon. Spend $25 on the mouse pad instead? <laughs> yeah. Do you think a curved ultra wide monitor is bad for a laptop? Uh, it depends. Not necessarily. What raceways do I use? If you go to my Amazon store, um, which is I think linked in the description, um, it should be there. I have a cable management a cable management thing on there. If not, I can link it in chat. Here, I'll uh Hopefully my internet doesn't die here. It's looking like YouTube's going to die or my internet's going to die. One of the two. Please don't die, internet. Um, Should I get a job at 14 or I can just wait until 15? I, I don't think people should dump all their money into to their setup. As much as I'm a setup channel, dude, just buy the bare minimum. Get Do things on a budget. Facebook Marketplace, anything like that. Um, you know, spend some time doing that. Oh my God. I just signed out. No, dude. I hate that feature by YouTube, bro. I hate it so much. Such a idiotic feature. I swear to God, bro. Like actually such a bad feature. YouTube's in shambles. Yeah, I can't even sign in. Wow. I actually dog. YouTube's falling apart. Um, Loki regret getting a vision pad instead of GA. I, I mean, I, I obviously don't want people to think that like another brand is better than mine or not better than mine or whatever. I don't care, dude. Just get what you like. Um, bro shitting on an employer. Hey man. I just want I just want more accountability out of them, man. They run a multi million dollar website, dude. Come on now. Like, come on, dude. Like, dude, Google is a multi-billion dollar company, dude. Like, they should have zero downtime ever. <laughs> you know what I mean? 
Thoughts on the Icy Sorrel mouse pad? I mean, I enjoy it. Because it's like, you know, obviously mine. All right. YouTube's dead. My band? What's going on here? I hate YouTube sometimes. It's so bad. I logged into the wrong account. Love it. Want a mouse pad, but I can't get one right now. I need to upgrade my mouse pad soon, though. Hey, man. Soon. Just, just buy what you need. What kind of graphics card do you have? I have two graphics cards. One in my streaming PC, which is a 3090, and then one in my game PC, which is a 4080. Um Yeah, repos. Yeah. Some some people have, you know, those things. I'll never shit on another company. Like, obviously, like I want everyone to succeed, but come on, dude. Why is this so bad? All right, here we go. We finally made it in there. Dude, the YouTube video today is banging off, dude. Did you guys like today's video? Did you guys watch today's video? Like, did you guys like it? Was today's video different than the other ones? Best cereal? Fruit Loops, by far. Best budget GPU? 4060, probably. Do you prefer a glass mouse pad or a normal one? Depends on what your use is for. The glass is more expensive, obviously, so, you know, it's probably going to be a little different. Today's live is fire. Thank you. Have you guys enjoyed the videos? Have you guys been enjoying the videos lately? Um, what GPU is best for an AMD Ryzen 5 